What's up, quarantine bunnies? I'm Hershey, and welcome back to Hershey's Guide. I'm up tired, okay? Tight earth with the T at the end. What's good, quarantine bunnies? So tonight we are gonna be working our abs and our arms, okay? Let's get it. All right, quarantine bunnies. So before we start any workout, what are we gonna do? Come on, y'all, say it with me. Don't be shy. Don't raise your hand all at once. Give you a hint, it's on the back of that big bird yellow wall behind me. Although you can't see the S. That's right. Go ahead. We are stretching. Okay. We are stretching our body. We are getting our minds right because we don't want any injuries. We want our blood flowing already before we get into our workout. Right. Right. Moving on. All right, y'all. So I decided to kick off my workout by doing my abs. That's right. It's time to get this FUPA in check. What I loved about this machine is that it had a pulley system, and I felt a lot of the workout in my abs. Um, it was very low intensity, but I definitely felt it. Now, this split screen I'm showing you is the green light that it had up top, which I appreciate it. So it's green for like 60 seconds, and then after 60 seconds, it turns red, and that's your rest period. I love this. It helped me build a rhythm. It helped me stay consistent. I really enjoyed this and will definitely do this again. Um, most importantly, too, like I said before, I felt this in my fupa, okay? Baby girl up here, I felt it right here. I'm, I'm grabbing my fupa as I speak to you guys. <laughs> but I didn't feel it in my back, okay? Versus the traditional sit-ups, you kind of feel it in your back. So I loved it. So sticking with the abs and getting that stomach right and tight, I wanted to whittle this waist. And I love this machine because the resistance, y'all, it took me for a loop, okay? It's a lot harder than what it looks. I had the weight, I believe, on 50 pounds. So I'm turning my like hips and waist. Y'all see this big old booty just turning, honey. Just just mooning and waving at everybody. I'm whittling my hips down, trying to make sure that I get this waistline right. But I really enjoyed this too. Um, I will say for a bigger person, please take care of your knees, okay? You're going to be on your knees. You're going to have that weight on your knees. Make sure you are taking advantage of um, the arm pull that's there, the handle. I'm going to call it the handle. There are two handles on top of this machine. So please put majority of your body weight on that so you're not putting it on your knees and hurting yourself, okay? Um, I am not a small girl, and there's no shame in my game, honey. I'm going to distribute all this body. Purred. Now, I wanted to get my arms a nice workout, too. So I, I did the this I believe this was the tricep or bicep machine. Y'all, don't hold me. I don't I can't quite remember. <laughs> but it worked my arms out, okay? I felt every bit of this. I believe I put the weights on 50 with this too. Um and I felt it. Y'all, I'm trying to get it right, you know? So this was cool. Um I was able to take my time, get a nice workout. I did about 15 reps twice. So, I felt good about it was proud of myself now for this machine i don't quite remember the name for this either <laughs> y'all i'm gonna get better i'm gonna start writing the names down as i go but i do remember that it worked out the back of your arms and like your your shoulder blades so you got a nice workout with that and i put the weight i believe 150 with this too i try i try to stay consistent with the weights um i usually go like 25 50 any more than that, then it's kind of rough for me. But um, this worked the back of your arms. I did about 15 of these and I did four reps of these. I felt it after I got done. I'm telling you, it was a beast. Ooh, okay, y'all. Abs again, but this is a, this, okay, let me tell you something. This machine here. You are lifting your body weight. Now, I've done it before, but I like to hit this usually every other workout. This thing, you are lifting your body weight. Y'all, 
you see me over there just struggling, honey, but I'm doing it. It's something about it that I feel like I'm conquering something. I don't know what it is. It just boosts my ego. Now, I can't do a lot of these. I think I only was able to do maybe 10 of these, I believe. Maybe 10, maybe 11-ish. I stopped counting after like seven because I'm like, ooh, I'm about to pass out. But this thing right here, you will definitely feel it. You're getting an arm workout, an ab workout. My booty cheeks is clenching as well because I'm scared. <laughs> you feeling everything. So I enjoy this. I definitely feel like this is one of my favorite machines too. All right, in closing of this episode, ladies and gentlemen, my quarantine bunnies, <laughs> I ended it on the treadmill. Y'all, I wanted to get some cardio before I left. And let me just tell y'all, I wanted to walk up out of there after I got done lifting my entire booty up in that machine. But I said, you know what? Just cool down, decompress, <laughs> get on the treadmill. So I did 20 minutes uh, with the incline of 2.0. I was happy about it and I was proud of myself. So to wrap this up, ladies and gentlemen, my quarantine bunnies, I want to thank you for joining me. Thank you for following me, giving me the inspiration to keep going. If you have any comments, please feel free to put it in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Hershey's Guide. I'll be seeing you soon. Peace.